Aminocaproic acid is an antifibrinolytic drug. Aminocaproic acid is primarily used as prophylaxis to prevent bleeding after cardiac surgeries, as well as in patients with cirrhosis. In cirrhotic patients the liver is unable to synthesize clotting factors. This drug is also used to prevent recurrence of subarachnoid hemorrhage. Talking about the mechanism of action. Aminocaproic acid works by inhibiting conversion of plasminogen to plasmin, which prevents clot breakdown and stops the bleeding. Aminocaproic acid is available in various formulations, including an oral solution, oral tablets, and IV solutions. When aminocaproic acid is administered orally, it is rapidly absorbed by the body, with nearly complete absorption occurring in the gastrointestinal tract. Aminocaproic acid is primarily excreted by the kidneys. Decrease the dose of drug in cardiac, renal, or hepatic disease. Common side effects of aminocaproic acid include malaise, muscle weakness, bradycardia, hypotension, as well as injection site reactions. Less commonly, aminocaproic acid can cause gastrointestinal side effects like abdominal cramps, nausea, and diarrhea. Finally, prolonged use of aminocaproic acid may lead to myopathy with rhabdomyolysis, which may ultimately result in acute renal failure. Now, if we talk about some contraindications of aminocaproic acid. This drug is contraindicated in patients with disseminated intravascular coagulation, cardiac, renal, and hepatic diseases, as well as pregnancy. So, that was all about clinical pharmacology of aminocaproic acid. Hope you like this video. For more pharmacology pearls, keep sharing and keep supporting us. Thank you.